Hi guys, welcome to Universal Dance Studios YouTube page. If you haven't done so already, subscribe to our page. So today I'm going to show you a hair tutorial for what we're going to use for our recital. So um, I'm just saying that you can have your hair um, straight or you can have it curly, whichever way your hair is naturally. You don't need to do any um, extra heat products. So you're going to use hairspray gel and then you're going to use a pushback brush, which is a brush that has more bristles. It's not like your regular brush. This one actually pushes back your hair compared to your regular brush. Another brush that's alike to it is a teasing brush. It has the same amount of bristles, it's just in a smaller size. Okay, you're going to need a comb, and this is to make the line on top of your forehead. And then you're going to need two scrunchies, and then you're going to need two types of bobby pins. You're going to need a closed bobby pin, and this is to keep um, little baby hairs away from your face. And then you're going to use your open bobby pin and this is going to help keep your bun intact. From there, we are going to get our comb and we're actually going to make a line from the bridge of our nose all the way to the back. So making a line there. Um, try to make it as straight as you can, okay? Make sure it's on the middle of your fo um, forehead. And again, just making it straight as best as you can. From there, you are actually going to tie up one side and we are going to work um, with each side individually. So just get a scrunchie, tie it up. And then you're going to use your gel first. So you're going to get your gel, you're going to put about a quarter size on your hand and you are going to put it in your hair. You want to concentrate it to the top of your hair because that is the part that needs more forming and that's the part that needs to be pushed back. So you see there, I'm putting it on top. And rub, rub, rub. And now I'm gonna get my push back brush and I'm gonna brush it back. So I'm gonna br brush, but I'm not brushing like I'm gonna do a ponytail. I'm just brushing it down, just to get it away from my face. Okay, there you go. Um, if you put enough gel on your curly hair, your hair should eventually become straight. <laughs> okay, so there you go. I get my little mirror and I'm going to show you the back. Eventually I turn around and I show you the back and look how when I hold my hair, you can really see how straight it is. Okay. Do the same exact thing to the other side. So you're going to get the same thing, a quarter of gel. Start rubbing it to the top and then you are going to brush it back lots and lots of brushing and lots and lots of gel so push it back again you want to make sure um, your hair is going behind your ears okay so now I mix my hair together so I still have that line in the middle though okay you don't want to pass it so you're eventually you're going to create a low ponytail so I turn around again and I show you how it looks on the back. So there you go. Hairspray. So hairspray everything. Now bush back brush again. And we're going to now make sure everything's pinned down. Okay. So keep brushing. So you're going to keep brushing. You don't want to have any bumps in your hair, okay? So you want to have it as straight as possible as you can. Okay, so you see how I'm brushing my hair? And it's becoming straight. I like to brush my hair over and over again to make sure I have every single strand of hair down. Okay, and now you see how I'm creating already my low ponytail. So I'm starting to grab the hair and I'm starting to put it all in my hand. Okay, and I'm creating already the form. So now I got my scrunchie, and if you need more than one, you can use more than one. I just need one though, and you're gonna tie up your hair. So now you see I have no bumps on the side, and I turn around and you see how straight it is, and it's as low as it can be. Now we're going to start and create our bun. So the first thing I like to do is put hairspray on my bun. 
okay so there you go through spraying it and now I'm gonna use my bun maker to make my bun so there you go I have a bun maker so what it is it's just it opens and it closes and you put your hair in the middle to it and then you close it okay so I'm gonna open it and I'm gonna put my hair through it and again I close it so it tries to make it kind of tightens my hair but not really and then I'm gonna turn around and I'm going to start wrapping it okay so you see it doesn't have to be perfect just do it as best as you can and then you're going to close that to make a circle now from there you can spread out your hair if you have a bunch of layers this is going to be a little bit hard if not then it should be as just as easy as that okay so with those hairs that are sticking out, I'm now going to use my bobby pins, my open ones, and I'm going to start bobby pinning those hairs. So I'm getting all my bobby pins gathered up together. Turn around. And I'm going to start off with that little bit of hair. So I'm going to try to stick it in as best as I can to hide it. And then I'm going to start bobby pinning so it stays in place. Okay, you want to make sure that your bun is super tight because if you shake your head, you don't want your bun falling. So I'm just sticking more bobby pins in it. There you go. More, more, more. The more bobby pins, the better. There's never too many bobby pins. Okay, you see how I shake my head, nothing came out. Okay, I added about six bobby pins. Okay, there you go. If you need, you can put a hairnet on top of your bun, even though you're using the donut, just to make sure that all your hair stays in that donut, okay? So what I do now is I just add another scrunchie. I just feel more safe. Um, I feel like my bun will stay more if I have another scrunchie on there. And that's pretty much it, and that's how I make my buns, okay? So I turn around one more time to show you everything as the finished product. So there you go. There's my bun okay this bun can literally be made in five minutes the video is longer just because i have to talk to it but then um i just brush everything back just in case if um you have any bumps on the side just get your little um closed bobby pins and you can close um you can push back your hair as well um if you have any bangs you might need those closed bobby pins as well but that's pretty much everything guys I hope you guys enjoyed the tutorial. I hope this guys helps you for your recital. If you still need any help, just come ask me or Claudia. And we will be glad to help you. Thank you. And bye.